Okay, welcome back to the complete website builder tutorial where uh, you can learn how to build a free website using the MobiRise software for your small business or your organization. <clears throat> In this video we're going to cover how to use the uh, code editor. So this could be a little bit more advanced feature just to let you know up front. So it requires that you know some HTML and CSS which are the basic building blocks, the basic languages of publishing websites online. And so it allows you to actually insert customized HTML and CSS blocks into your website. So not only the, the predefined blocks that MobiRise is set up, but if you have some coding skill or if you're able to pull some code in from a different place, you can actually put it into, um, into your website. <clears throat> okay, so let's go to uh, our content block. It's all the way down at the bottom at the very end. It's called HTML. You can see this is the uh, these brackets are the what you use in HTML and you'll see it when I open it. So you just click on this. Let's just add it right here. You can see what comes up. It says click to show the code editor. So it doesn't come up automatically. Um, there are no actual parameters other than to edit the code. So you can click here or you can click here. So let's just click on it and now it opens up <clears throat> our HTML editor and it also opens up a CSS editor. Now you can, if you're working on one or the other, you can kind of minimize um, one over the other. It's telling you type valid CSS and HTML here. Um, what we have here is if you don't like what you're doing, say you're typing something up here, you don't like that, you can actually cancel it and close. It'll tell you that your changes won't be saved. Yes, that's okay. And then it will not save the changes. You can also save and close it, and then it will accept the changes. <clears throat> and you can also preview uh, what that's going to look like. So let's say we just want to add uh, some simple text. <clears throat> so this is just a paragraph. Um, and then let's add a heading one in here. So what, the, what this should output is a large, um, my first heading should be large, and then this should be a regular text, uh, a block of text. <clears throat> now this is not style, this is just regular HTML, there's no style attached to it, other than what the style is for this theme. So let's go ahead and uh, preview it. And you can see uh, down in the bottom left, down here you can see it's my first heading and then my first HTML text block. <clears throat> um, these are all the default styles for uh, MobiRise. You could also add an image um, but it requires that you have a source so you have to figure out where your images are located. Um, typically you're going to have this all set up on the back end uh, if you are a web developer, then you know how file structure works. And if you're not a web developer, <clears throat> the code editor probably is not a place that you're going to deal with very much. Um, but it's good to know that you can add in text blocks if you need to. So let's say I wanted to change this. I could give it a class of... Uh, my first heading... That would probably be a terrible class name, but <clears throat> so oh, we can come down now and we can style each of these elements. So we can do is do. Uh, size and we'll 
we'll do uh, trying to figure out some things here that you'll be able to see and uh, color <clears throat> is um, we'll just do red Let's see if it accepts that so let's preview it so you can see now our <clears throat> our heading has changed to red which is a color you can see the line height shift a little bit which is the how much space is above and below and then the font size didn't change much but if we do that maybe it'll show suppose there's a, a limit let's see let's do four. okay I uh, changed it. So <clears throat> the size of the font definitely changed. It enlarged. And our line height also increased and we colored it red. We do the same thing just for the sake of <clears throat> just for the sake of the tutorial. Let's do uh see how that goes. So text transform means that it uh, makes all the blocks or all the letters um, uppercase, lowercase, or normal. So in this case I have switched it so that they're all uppercase. And this is done not up here. You can see it's not uppercase. It's done in the CSS. And also it's made the font weight bold. Now if I take that off, you should be able to really see it. <coughs> Seems like a, a bold piece of text anyway. Um, and then you can change the color on that too. That's easy to, to see the difference. And so now it's blue. So that's basically using the uh, HTML editor. At this point you cannot drop in JavaScript as far as I know. Uh, that will work here. You have to change the JavaScript. Um, you have to create a new file. And then you would have to maybe reference that file in the main parts of the uh, the main parts of the MobiRise website you'd have to use some sort of editor outside of MobiRise so this is only within the contained block but I hear that there are plans to create like fully custom blocks um, that you're customizing completely yourself where you have a lot of a lot more control than what's here so this is using the editor when you're ready to, to save that. You just click the green check mark. And then now you have a fully functioning uh, block of text that you can you can have inside of your uh, your MobiRise editor. So that is <clears throat> and then you can move that block down or up. So you can see here that this is uh, not going to show. So it's going to show our text block here. You can see it's uh, not bolded, it's red. So this is the code editor for uh, MobiRise. So it gives you some ways to build in some more powerful things with just uh, HTML and CSS. And uh, thank you for joining me for this one, and I will make sure you watch some of the other videos to learn how to build the website uh, using MobiRise.